Hey guys, it's Shannon. And Paul. You want me to leave that in there? I don't know. <laughs> I'll put it in there or not. Just in case we'll start over. Hey guys, it's Shannon. And Paul. And today we are doing... What's in my bag? <laughs> so normally the what's in my bag videos are women's handbags, but we thought it'd be fun to do like a different twist on that. Yeah. Actually, this was Paul's idea, and I think it was a good idea. Now, fun fact. Paul's very clever. Yeah, fun fact, I actually carry Shannon's handbag quite a bit. He does. Um, it's not something that embarrasses me, it never has. I've always been fine with it. Um, it's just Shannon has kind of changed her style as far as what kind of bags she carries. She used to carry stuff with a shoulder strap, and I can totally do a shoulder strap bag or like a crossbody, but I don't know what 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 like the the design is, but a it's coke, like um, it's like a satchel. A satchel. She like you know has it on like the the forearm or the crook of her arm, and it's just not my thing. So so I got myself a bag. <laughs> so was it last year or two years ago you bought this? This is two years ago now. Okay, so two years ago when we were in New York for Toy Fair, he bought this messenger um, bag or laptop yeah, bag, whatever. Messenger bag. Yeah. Um, shout out to the Coach Store in on Fifth Avenue. On Fifth Avenue, they yeah. were very nice. They helped him pick yeah. out a good bag, yeah. and he loves it. I do. I carry this every week with me to church. Um, anytime we go somewhere that you know that I know that I'm going to be you know carrying stuff around, I take this with me. Um, I love it. I think it's great. So today he's going to show you what's in his bag. Okay, so I don't know how these videos go. I have never in my life watched a what's in my bag video, so I have no idea what I'm supposed to do. So you're going to show us what's in it. All right. Um, <laughs> so do I show the bag? Sure. First. Okay, okay, so, so it, it has a pocket back here. Um, all the pockets are really nice. They're lined. There's nothing in that pocket. Okay. <laughs> so. And just so you know, the camera, whoa, it went blurry. The camera we're using to film with right now is actually going, going to, be to be in that bag. Right. Plus, here, I'll hold it up and show you guys. Wait, let's see. Can you see? Oh, you can see my head. I don't know. It's got a big tripod on it that he's going to have that in his bag too. So. Yeah. Now, I'm actually looking at the camera. I see a big piece of kitty fur. A kitty fur? On the lens. I'm hoping... <laughs> oh, it's gone. I got it. I can't believe that worked. <laughs> Good job. I thought we were going to have to stop filming. I was going to have to get it. So Thank in you. case that was messing up the focus or like it was there Maybe. in the beginning, it's gone now. It was bothering me. So, all right. Okay. Uh, let's open up the flap. So I like that... I like this closes. It has a magnetic closure right here. Open the flap up. Um, so a couple things about me when I'm like in the city or something, I don't like stuff in my pockets as much as possible. Um, so my wallet, you don't want to be pickpocketed. Yeah. I'm kind of like paranoid about it. I know that it's really <laughs> silly, but like we're in the tourist areas. Um, it's not silly. It can happen. Yeah. People the, are really close to you. Yeah. I mean, and you know, when it's like rush hour in Times Square, you know, you're, you know, you're bumper to bumper with people. Yep. Um, there's a lot <laughs> bumper of bump, to bumper. Yeah, there's a lot of bumping and pushing and stuff and I'm just paranoid. So if I have my wallet in my hands, it's always in my front pocket with my hand in the same pocket with this. So it's going to have to work if they're going to try and pickpocket me. Um, <laughs> might get mugged, but I'm not going to get pickpocketed. All right, so, so you I'm, just lay everything out on the table once you take it out of your okay. bag. So I have my wallet. So real quick, with my wallet, when I travel, um, I usually take, this is actually kind of thick right now. I'm going to take a couple of cards out of here. Um, I take out all the non-essentials. So like all of the grocery store membership cards, my gym membership card, um, things like that. That will not be in here. It's just going to be like my ID, uh, debit card, things like essentials. that. Essentials. Yeah, the essentials. Okay. Shannon, uh, this is something of Shannon's. Oh, yeah, this is... What's in Shannon's purse? It's Paul's purse. Yeah. So <laughs> that's upside down. There okay. you go. So I just have this, it's a card case and it just holds small, you know, credit card mm -hmm. type things. I have my, I just take my license, credit cards, cash, just the small few things I need. And I put in that when we travel, I'm not going to open it up because I don't want to show those things off. <laughs> okay. And next up, I have Ooh, cash. You're loaded in here. So um, look at all those ones. <laughs> yeah. So again, I'm probably gonna I'm probably gonna have a couple of you know small bills in my pocket. Uh, this is mostly ones, you know, and some fives and tens and stuff like that. Um, I always like to have a little bit of cash on me um, if if I can. Now, if I'm around town locally, I usually don't have any cash on me. Um, but whenever I'm traveling, I like to have a little bit on me just in case of emergencies. The small bills I need for tips and for vending machines. Um, you know, and then the larger bills, just in case, like we need to jump in a cabin or something like that. And they don't take credit cards. Okay. So that's everything in that Everything pocket. in there? 
I don't think, no, I don't have anything in there. I might actually change. Well, you have another secret pocket. Yeah, I might actually change the location of some things. All right, opening up okay, here. The so, big compartment. So this is actually quite full. Um, I didn't realize how full this was going to yes. be. Yes. So we're going to start right here. I have two bottles of water in here, one for Shannon, one for myself. Um, I always like to, I, we always like to carry a bottle of water with us because, you know, in case you get thirsty or something like that, uh, you know, especially in <laughs> any kind of tourist area. I Shannon's don't like, not using a water fountain. Yeah, Shannon doesn't use any, any water fountains or anything like that. <laughs> Personally, in like New York, I'm not going to either. I, although I don't mind using public water fountains like around town. Um, in New York, no. Nah. Um, but I also don't want to pay three or four dollars for a bottle of water. So, uh, you know, we usually, we usually buy a case of water when we get, you know, wherever we're going and we'll carry stuff with us. Or fun fact, some of the nicer stores like on Fifth Avenue that you mm -hmm. shop at, they'll actually give you waters if you're in there shopping. Yes. <laughs> so. Yeah. Okay. Um, okay. let's see. I've got a pen. A pen. You know, in case you need to make notes. Well, I guess I shouldn't. Stuff. It doesn't want to um, like zoom in. Got Shannon's phone. Woo, that is filthy looking. The screen is filthy. I can see Shannon it. Shannon needs to clean her phone. I need to clean my phone. This is my new phone case. Isn't it pretty? It is it's going to blind me in the sunlight because it's purple glittery. All right. Here's my phone case. There's Paul's. I like I, his phone. I have the same phone case that I've had since I bought this phone. Shannon has had like four or five different cases. <sighs> okay. Um, I have... Because phone cases are a fashion accessory, these. like handbags. You so have to change them. These are reading glasses. And since I am over 45, <laughs> I need these. Um, actually, since I'm You're not 40. over 45. You are 45. You're not over. My memory's going now, too. <laughs> okay, so ever since I've been 43, I've needed these. So uh, this is going to be a glasses reveal here. Oh, you look so these, very studious. Oh, well, thank you. Professor I have Hall. no idea how I look with these on. I Here, have, hold on. I'm going to flip never... the, camp, the screen up oh, so you me. can see. Oh, my, I look so much like Drew right now. <laughs> I look exactly like our, like our oldest son. That's funny. It really kind of is. That's amazing. <laughs> okay. So these are reading glasses, which... Just it, in case you need to read a it's menu. It's amazing how it's sharper everything looks when I put those on. <laughs> I, think I, need, right? I think I need glasses. <laughs> All right. Um, what else is in your see. bag of goodies? I have, this is an absolute essential for me. This is chapstick. Chapstick. Um, I use chapstick all the time. And on, for me, only the blue or the black tube, that's it. No, yes, no, he's very particular. And it's got to be chapstick brand. <laughs> so. Plus loyal to chapstick. I am. All right. Go. Super important for the airplane. Yes. As, go ahead. As well as for breath freshening. Yes, but when we take off and land, I have to chew gum because I hold my breath and like stop swallowing and then my ears don't like yeah. adjust to the altitude. So I need gum or something to make, to force me to like swallow and not just sit there and like, <gasps> yeah. I mean, I hold my breath as long as I can. <laughs> I don't have that problem. I don't. I hate I, airplanes. I don't need gum, you know, for... <clears throat> For it's a comfort thing. Yeah, for any of that, for an airplane. Um, but we I, are going to be talking to a lot of yeah, people too. Yeah, so. for fresh breath. Um, real quick, since you brought up airplanes, I meant to say this. Don't take th these through airport security. I have, have a really bad problem <laughs> of doing that. We have tried to do it twice and then stopped by security. And hold I had the line. bomb people come yeah, out. It's, to, it, it always gets swabbed. To swab it, my it's, water. It's and a problem. It, you know why? Why? It was Hasbro. Hasbro did it yeah. to me. One year we went to the Hasbro event and they had these really cute little water bottles and they were wrapped in transformers. Oh, like yeah. wrapped, they were amazing. And I'm like, I'm gonna take this home and show my kids. But it was full. <laughs> and I took it through security and that became an issue. That was the end of that. And then we forgot and we did the same thing the very next year. Yep. And then when we went to California, we almost did the same thing, but we caught ourselves. <laughs> so don't try and go through security with water bottles. <laughs> They don't take it. You'll get stopped every yeah, single time. They don't like it. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh, next up, we have business cards. So no this business. is a bag full of business cards for us to hand out at Toy yes, Fair toy reviews. for people that we meet. Um, let's see. This is That's my bag. bag. This is Shannon's bag. That's Shannon's bag. Are you want to show everything that's in there? Oh, um, yeah. You I'll, can save I'll, that to the end. I'll tell you what. I'm going to oh, we'll save that to the end. Okay. Other very important stuff. Um, <laughs> drugs. drugs. <laughs> <laughs> Not really. It's 
Okay. Motrin. So this is Motrin or ibuprofen. Actually, it's generic ibuprofen from okay. Sam's Club. Uh, compared to the, to the name brand Motrin. <laughs> and this is generic, I cannot even pronounce what it is, but it's basically Pepsin. So this is, uh, you know, in case we get indigestion, this is in case we have a headache or something. And we rarely have to take this stuff, but, but it's good. It's one of those things that if you want it and you don't have it, you're miserable. And okay. it costs a lot to buy it and then go find it if you need it. Yeah, it does. So we've gotten in the habit of just taking it yeah. with us just in case. Yep. So we buy the big bottles from the membership clubs and then we have these little plastic bags that we break, you know, put it down into and whatever. And then I have a bunch of little bags with individual pills that I sell to people. No, I'm teasing. No, you don't do that. <laughs> I'm teasing. <laughs> okay. Um, let's see. That's the end of that. I have another, I have one more pocket in here. We have a cell phone charger. Very important. Yep. Especially on a long day at the convention center, the phones wear down. All right, I have these. These are lens cleaning wipes. These will work on camera lenses, cell phone screens, or glasses. Cool. So those are important. And one last thing, this is absolute lifesaver. One of the best inventions of how many, how long, ever long I've been around, 20 years? Babies. <laughs> Those the, are toothpick, <laughs> tooth flosser things. Yep, tooth flosser things. Uh, it's got a little piece of dental floss there in the middle of the little plastic thing. And that's perfect if you end up eating and you have something caught in your teeth and you just... And it having something caught in your teeth is one of, it, it's one of the layers of hell. I'm just telling you. <laughs> probably like the second layer of hell or something. It's like, you know, popcorn kernels and just a bunch of stuff caught in your teeth. Where, you know, you have to sit there and just pick at it all day with your tongue and it just will never come out. This will get it out. That's funny. You're so, funny. So I actually might go to the store and buy a plastic case for these because the, this end, these ends right here are really sharp and it might poke through this plastic and scratch the lining of the bag up. Um, we could put them in my little bag if you wanted. Okay. Okay, that's everything. So now okay, we... so let's let's just look at the table real quick. So this is everything he has in there. Plus, he's gonna have this like five pound camera in there along with a little octopus looking tripod yeah okay, okay. so you want to see what's in my bag yeah so are you going to explain what's in my bag he has no idea what's in there. <laughs> no idea what's in here are you gonna are you gonna explain what's in there if you want me to give it a try sure okay we have sugar because shannon is sweet <laughs> and this is how she stays sweet she has lots of sugar. Okay, they're gonna they're gonna enjoy that. Um, the sugar brand. Oh. That's that's my version of chapstick. Okay. If you unscrew it, mine is fancy. It unscrews. Unscrew it. Okay. Oh yeah, you don't have the little plastic. And then if you just look, it's just clear like chapstick. You know, lip balm. That's oh, in yeah. case in New York when it's real windy, my lips get chapped so bad. So I have to take that. Okay. <laughs> Sugary. Sugar. I, I want to point out, look at his face. <laughs> no, go ahead. He's digging in there. He's so excited. Okay. Okay, you can grab that one out and there's one more in there. Okay, so we have hand soap. So we have hand sanitizers. All right. Because one can never be too careful, especially this trip. <laughs> okay. So Shannon has actually showed me both of these. I have approved both scents. Yes. Yeah. It's so, important to get your husband's scent approval. Yeah, so I knew what these were. <laughs> yeah, I knew what these were. But actually, you did call them hand soaps. I did. They're hand sanitizers. Whatever. <laughs> Shannon uses these a lot. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna- Not a own, lot. I'm gonna own this. I don't use these, <laughs> so, so um, yeah, I wash my hands if I'm gonna eat or something, but I'm just, I, I just, I'm not a hand sanitizer. Person. Normally, I'm not either. I have it in the car and I will use it, but I don't even carry one in my purse usually. But I have a really bad habit of touching my mouth and eyes. And you know, there's a lot of people sick with the flu, even around us. But you know, there's there's different concerns and I want some hand sanitizer. That way, yeah. we're gonna be shaking a lot of hands, touching a lot of things. Yeah. I'm taking my hand sanitizer. There you go. Okay, Shannon's, okay. Gonna, Shannon's gonna live, I might. <laughs> Okay, yeah, we've got a purple disc. This is a very, very small Frisbee. <laughs> it's a transformer. <laughs> it has a mirror, which is important for putting your lipstick on. And it's a hairbrush. It's a hairbrush. 
It's actually a wet brush brand, okay. I think. No, maybe that one's not a wet brush brand. It's not. Okay. There is a mirror. I'm looking at myself right now. How do you look? Uh, I look fabulous. <laughs> yeah, I don't think that's going to do any good. Oh, yeah, much better. <laughs> <laughs> it's important for me. My hair gets tangled, like in knots. Yeah. Just push it back. Okay. That's... My hair can turn into a tangled okay. knot in like no time flat, so... Oh man, I could have played with this with Star Wars figures when I was a kid. It's like, like the, the Starlight Star Pit? Yeah, the Starlight. Wow, good job, Shannon. The Starlight <laughs> Pit. I have like a little Boba Fett up here. He'd fall in. <laughs> That'd be awesome. See, girls have all the best toys. <laughs> they do. Okay. Okay, what else is in there? All right. Oh, we have New York X. <laughs> That's NYX lipstick. Okay. That's the lipstick I was wearing in the recent video. Oh, okay. Um, that I filmed with Paul. That he said he liked that color, so I I'm really, taking that color really to New York. I like that color. Hang on here. I can't read it. I don't know what color it is. <laughs> Good I, thing I have the glasses. I really can't read this. So I do want to point oh, wow, out. It's so much bigger. <laughs> I can read. <laughs> I couldn't read before. All this was blurry. I'm just trying to read it. Paul is. Really good at makeup, and he didn't know because he told me when I wore that in a video. He said, I really like it because it's like not gloppy and glossy, it's matte, and yeah. that actually is a matte version. Matte. So that is from my NYX advent calendar yeah. that I did recently. Rouge à lèvres. Now, I don't normally. I'm not pronouncing that right, I'm sure. I don't normally wear that color. I thought it was like too bright and too much for me, but Paul nope. said it was really good, so well, I'm wearing really. it. Oh, it's professional makeup. Shannon must be a professional, otherwise, she wouldn't be able to use this. Yeah. What's the color? Uh, is it on the end? No, uh, it's not on the end of the Natural. End. No. Oh yeah, it is natural. Maybe maybe that's the line? No. Nope. I don't know. That's probably the color. Let you me think see that's it. The color? Okay, there you go. Alright. I think All that's right, the moving. color. I'm keeping the glasses on. <laughs> yep, natural. We have band-aids. Yes. Which... Another thing that if you need, you want to have. <laughs> Shannon learned that on the last trip we went on. Yes. Okay, a couple more things here. We have that's lip gloss. Marker? Oh, <laughs> it's lip gloss. It's lip gloss. Okay, so this does look gloppy to me. Now I did have a little bit of that on over that matte lipstick in the video, and you still said you liked it, so that's why I'm taking it. And okay. that's one of my products that I'm trying to use up in 2020. Okay. So there we go. So lip. That's a lip glaze. Yep. Not a gloss. Okay. And we also have the Simpsons. That's my trusty standby, like my favorite color lip gloss ever. Okay. That's a MAC Simpsons, and it is that color purple that yeah. you see right there. This is itchy and scratchy and sexy. <laughs> okay, I would, oh my gosh, I would never be, yeah. There's no way I would be able to read that. <laughs> you okay. guys are experiencing Paul, experiencing the joy of okay. the glass. Last thing in here, we have holiday gel. <laughs> we have Mary Thing. It's Mary Thing. Mary Thing. <laughs> Vanilla Bean Noel. It's hand cream. Okay. It's hand lotion. Because oh, yeah, again, so it's right when it's dry and windy in New York, my hands like start getting chapped a little bit, yeah. and so I want some lotion with us, okay. just in case I need cream it. Noel. I'm gonna sniff this and see what this smells like. It smells good. It's a good scent. Yeah, it smells vanilla y sort of. It just has like a hint of vanilla. I think it smells like think. vanilla cake. You think like everything. You smell, <laughs> so many times she's she's like, I love this lipstick. It smells like vanilla cake. I'm like, I don't smell it. Some of the lipsticks do have a cake scent. Um, I forget what brand it is. I have one. It has a cake scent. Is it Laura Geller? <laughs> you guys back me up in the comments. I they don't have think it cake smells. Like smells. Cake. I think this smells like some kind of cream. Let me smell it again. Maybe with a hint of vanilla. Let me smell it. That is so cake. It smells like buttercream frosting. Squeeze it out at your nose. So a little puff of air comes yeah, out. Yeah, I mean, I smell, I, I am smelling. It's cake, buttercream frosting. I've got a cake in the refrigerator. We're gonna blindfold. You have cake in the refrigerator? Yeah, from Casey's birthday. Oh, it's not good that's cake. old cake. It's old cake. Maybe that's what this, old cake. <laughs> All right, so this is probably the longest what's in my bag video that anybody's ever done, and that's because you know oh. Paul and I can't do a short video. Because it's a guy doing it. It's 20 we're out, guys. We're at 20 minutes. Oh, wow. Holy cow. Yeah. Okay. That's a long video. All right, video. do we need so, to wrap this up? Okay, so Paul is going to be carrying all that stuff, plus the camera, yeah. except plus for the when camera. the camera is out filming. 
if we're filming. We haven't decided on that or yep. not yet. But that's it. That's it. What do you have to say for yourself? Are you proud of your bag? I am. I love my bag. I mean, it fits all this stuff well. It, the, the weight is distributed. It looks good, I think. Um, it does. You know, yeah, I'm, I'm very happy with it. And that way I get to keep my pockets free. Shannon doesn't have pockets in what she'll be wearing, so I'll have all her stuff. She doesn't have to worry about anything. I can just take care of it all. And when she needs something, I can get, you know, she can go in my bag or she can be like, hey, I need this. And I'll be like, there you go. There you go. So, and, <laughs> and just a tip in case your husband's carry your stuff and you're going somewhere, a bag like this with the little, uh, with the little strap is perfect because when you take it to the bathroom, like if you want to fix your makeup or whatever, you can hang that little strap on the back of the bathroom door. Oh, hey, good tip. That way you don't have to set your bag down somewhere where you don't want to set it. Cool. So take a bag with a strap. Oh, good tip. Uh, <laughs> again, would never think about that. All right, you can sign off. All right, well, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Please leave comments down below. Let me know about that whole cake thing. Or yeah. On side or you on channel side. Back me up on the cake yeah. stuff. All right, leave the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it, and we will see you guys next time. Bye, guys.